Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video I'm going to show you how you can create integrations between Rike and Jira. First of all, we need to create an account at uh, rike.com and uh, now we are greeted by this uh, 14 days left uh, free trial. So it's actually uh, quite some time to find out if this is a, a good solution for your company. And But back to integrations. Uh, we need to go to the top right corner of our screen uh, where uh, our profile is and we want to press it by the left uh, mouse button. We want to go to the uh, third options from, the, from up there, uh, which is apps and integrations. And we need to find Jira here. If you can see it straight away, uh, we can uh, use our search engine and as you can see there's a Jira. We press Jira but uh, uh, you need to buy right integrate package, right integrate package. But don't worry there's a second way how we can make a simple integration and it's through Zapier. Uh, we also need to create an account at zapier.com and once we do that, we want to go to the top left corner. We want to make a zap. We'll get redirected into this page. Now we can name it like... Uh, uh, we can name it like uh, Reich Jaira. And now uh, we have to pick ourselves the first trigger app, which will obviously be Reich. Like this, we choose an event, there'll be new task or new folder. Let's go with new task. We press continue. Now we have to sign in with our Rack account. We want to press continue. We want to go to root. Let's go with, uh, it's a true that it happened. Uh, as a next step, there's a, you can test your trigger, but you don't actually have to. Uh, choose an account and set up a trigger. It's completely about how you uh, manage to tweak your account. So the second one is the app that will be affected by this trigger. In our case, it's Jira. So we press Jira, uh, desk, cloud, uh, let's go with desk. And there will be like create a request. We can change it to Jira cloud. And there is a couple of other options. It depends what you need. So now, if uh, the trigger will happen, which will be like new task in Rack, we'll update the issue in Jira. We press continue. And now we just have to sign into our uh, Jira software cloud. So that's about it. Thanks for watching and see you on the next video.